cześć wam i chwała żołnierze, z tej strony Kokosfly, a to jest Battlefield 3 Szturm. E, na operacji Metro gramy na serwerze Privat Kesserei, a jest ze mną gość specjalny, czyli Kondoliza, dlatego dzisiaj będziemy rozmawiali e, przede wszystkim po angielsku, również trochę po polsku, ale mam nadzieję, że to was nie zrazi. E, hi Kondoliza. Hello Kokos. How are you? <laughs> Fine. Już trochę rozmawialiśmy, ale pozapisowałem sobie trochę pytań. Uh, so, Condoleezza, I have a couple of questions to you. Okay. Uh, what weapon will you use right now and what is your favorite weapon? <laughs> I'm using cheese, cheese 3 A3 now and uh -huh. this is my favorite weapon in Battlefield 3. So, you have uh, on G3A3 uh, about 100 stars, right? Yeah, some of them. Okay, so maybe I will ask you a question that is most expected when you record or play with a girl. Uh, so, uh, how long have you been playing Battlefield? Why Battlefield? Why video games? Uh, you know, those stereotypes, girls and video games are not matching together. So, what do you, what do you think about it? What is your motivation to play? Uh, I love playing games, I like the competition, and I'm playing since many years now. <laughs> since I'm 15 years old about. Mm -hmm. and I started online multiplayer gaming with Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. And then came to Battlefield, that company too. Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. So, uh, were you playing on ESL or, or Sports no. League? No. No. So that wasn't Just for fun. Aha, uh -huh, right. And uh, why Battlefield? Why Battlefield and not Call of Duty? Because, uh, okay, uh, now I will tell uh, maybe my, my viewers who are you and how do I know you in Polish. E, więc e, słuchajcie, teraz wam powiem dlaczego, skąd znam Kondolizę i kim generalnie jest Kondoliza. Otóż Kondoliza jest e, kobietą, która jest administratorem na serwerach Privet Kesserei. E, to są serwery, które e, są zarówno w Battlefield 4, jak i Battlefield 3. Są to naprawdę bardzo e, ogarnięte, świetne serwery, na których uwielbiam grać. Jest, e, są tam gracze, e, którzy grają zespołowo, którzy wiedzą co to jest defibrylator, nie boją się podnosić, nie boją się szturmować. E, w dodatku na tych serwerach w serwerach są zabronione na przykład karabiny snajperskie, zarówno wyborowe, jak i te DMR-y, czyli te samopowtarzalne. O cholera, chyba mnie przeniosło. Uh, you know, I, I was moved to, the, to another team. Can I move back? Uh, yes, please, or move uh, yourself. Oh. Maybe. Yeah, okay, let's see. So I was talking uh, to my uh, to my viewers that uh, I love your servers and uh, <laughs> your servers have uh, very very good players, you know. Uh, mm -hmm. Not maybe not good as uh, I don't know uh, 4000 KD ratio, but good as for um, uh, they are target oriented players and it's yeah. it's just wonderful. They're using defibrillators and stuff, uh, <laughs> which is not obvious to use for some of the players. And this is this is really great. Yeah, true. Uh, so uh, why why did you even um, started to have server? Why did um, you even to start server? We started to have an own server because we were annoyed by some stupid rules that other uh, servers have like uh, instant vehicle spawn or mm -hmm. we were not satisfied with the map cycle on other servers mm, yes yes and of course we have uh, bad admins that ban people just because they don't want to lose or don't want to play against two good players mm -hmm, right so you know i love your server not uh, not mainly because of uh, you know those players target oriented players but uh, because of admins <laughs> you won one one of the admin because uh, i i saw that uh, when 
uh, when game isn't balanced, you move yourself. You know, lumpen yes. pack, you and uh, basement stuff. I don't know if basement stuff is uh, <laughs> uh, an admin. No. Okay, <laughs> but you move yourself, and this is just great. I, uh, I'm not able to do that as myself when I'm admin. When my team uh, is uh, is winning, uh, it's just too difficult, too hard uh, for me to move myself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, most of or all of our our admins don't really care about the stats. You know, we're mm -hmm. playing for fun and not not to win or to have mm -hmm. high KD or high right. lose ratio. So we're playing to have exciting. Round. Uh, I see, I see. Uh, and uh, I want to ask you how many um, how many players that you know play on your server? You know, like uh, uh, the word is stable, but it's not that uh, meaning. You uh, mean regular? Players? Yeah, regular, regular players. Uh, how many? We have a lot them? of regular players, I would say. And uh, but it's difficult at the moment because we we are we have two servers running now in Battlefield 3 and one in Battlefield 4 and mm -hmm. so our our regular players uh, split it up a little bit so some some stay here in Battlefield 3 but some moved on to Battlefield 4 and so uh, you have only one server on Battlefield 4 because I saw Metro server, uh, not Metro, but uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, Operation Locker server. Yes, only. Um, that was just a co cooperation with some friends, mm -hmm. and we gave them our name for the server, but mm -hmm. it was their server. And we had to end the co cooperation because we had different points of view how to administrate the server. Mm -hmm, right. Uh, okay, so um, in a couple of days uh, we will have uh, another DLC, second DLC to Battlefield 4. So let's, uh, let's talk about Battlefield 4. Uh, in general, <laughs> do you enjoy it, and if not, why? <laughs> <laughs> no, I stopped playing Delphi 4 because mainly it's because it's too bugged in mm -hmm. many ways. The net code isn't good, and I really don't like the design of the maps. They are really bad. Badly made for playing Rush, mm -hmm. and I love playing Rush. Okay, yeah, you know, I I know what you mean exactly um, because uh, my I myself rage uh, when I stream on or where I when I play the game because of uh, netcode. Uh, my viewers know exactly what do I think about it. <laughs> so it's it's just broken, and I wonder how fantastic game could be spoiled uh, by by uh, by netcode because uh, you know it, in beta uh, battlefield yeah, 4 was, was kind of fine mm -hmm. right and then it was yes they just broke it why i don't understand it i think maybe it's because in the beta there were so many things um, disabled at the beginning there were uh, less weapons available, and I think that maybe that was the reason that it was. It felt better to play the better than the release game. Mm -hmm. Well, will will we make it on no. this map? <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> So how many hours uh, did you play um, in Battlefield 4, in Battlefield 3? A lot in Battlefield 3, uh, over 1000 hours, but I have no idea how many in Battlefield 4. Not that much, mm -hmm. but it's yeah, released later. <laughs> yeah, you have 
100 stars G3A3, free, free, so you should play a lot. I have over 1000 hours. <laughs> That's because why um, I, I enjoy Battlefield 4 right now. Uh, because it's something different than uh, BF3. Oh, it's so hard here, really. Don't I... you want to join my squad? Oh, oh, you are, oh, oh, okay, right. <laughs> I didn't notice that. One minute, one minute, okay. Where are you? Where are you? Ah, just one, one person squad, okay, I mean. Yeah, they left me alone. <laughs> Uh, okay, okay, maybe another question. Did you play Titanfall? Not yet. Uh, you know, uh, we talked about Titanfall earlier and I said that Titanfall is really wonderful, uh, wonderful game. Um, it's totally better than Call of Duty, in my opinion. But it's just uh, similar in a couple of ways. Uh, okay, uh, maybe maybe some other questions, or maybe you have a question for me, <laughs> <laughs> something like that. Nah, oh. that was too fast. <laughs> I'm not doing too well right now. Yeah, me neither. Oh Jesus, they just own us here. Okay, so your favorite class is, I think, Assault, right? Yes. Um, what do you think about Assaults in uh, Battlefield 4? And Okay, okay, another question, more complicated. Um, so, uh, what was your first impressions on the game, on the new Battlefield? Uh, what was um, so much different from Battlefield 3 that you, you couldn't stand? Except, of course, uh, this netcode, right? Yeah. Uh, let me think. Uh, the movement is kind of different to Battlefield 3 because it feels much lower. Like you're mm -hmm. more stick to the floor in Battlefield mm -hmm. 4. It's really hard to move or to react if, if you get shot or if somebody is shooting at you. It's really hard to, to run away. Yes, that's right, and you, you, you die so fast. Yeah, you uh, die fast, but you move slow. <laughs> it, yeah, it doesn't that's really right. fit together. Okay, uh, and uh, another question, because uh, your servers are, I think I can say that, are known from banning uh, for using uh, DMRs or sniper rifles, and why is like that? Why is it like that? Um. Because we don't like players who are just cam camping in the base, um, mm -hmm. playing for the, their KD and not doing anything for the team. And well, <laughs> you know, 99% of all players which play snipers are playing it like this. And we want players who rush and. You want just uh, you want to have active players, right? Yes. So that's the that's the main reason. Uh, well, I agree on that because uh, snipers are mainly useless, and um, snipers are mainly useless. Uh, and um, I talk a lot about it uh, in my gameplays. Uh, exception is when you use a sniper class with. Uh, PDW or something like that when you are yes. rushing, uh, placing thugs, thugs or um, spawn beacons, uh, it can be very useful. Yes. Uh, but mainly it's not. Yeah, but that's exactly our point of view, and that's why only the sniper rifles are forbidden and not the class on its own. Mm -hmm. So you're still allowed to play. Uh, sniper and place a beacon. 
Yeah, but... that's great. That's great of you. Okay, Kondo, uh, Kondi, as I as I call you sometimes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I really enjoyed talking with you because uh, that was the first time we talked. Um, uh, in private on TeamSpeak, so it was really nice to know you uh, from that side. Um, and uh, I hope you you enjoy it. <laughs> this yes, recording. very much. Thanks for inviting me. And uh, your friends can um, watch this <laughs> <laughs> after because uh, I know that you uh, that you watch my channel sometimes, but I talk in Polish, so it's not yeah. understandable, right? No. Okay, so I hope we will um, we will talk to each other soon and we will play with each other soon. So thank you very much. I dziękuję wam wielkie za to, że byliście do końca. Do zobaczenia na polu walki. Trzymajcie się. Hej, hej.